Jack and Daxter, an iconic PlayStation franchise that's loved by many and has been in demand for a return for a while now. There's talk going around about the dynamic duo possibly returning again on the PS5. And while the sources are on the levels of, dude, trust me, I thought it would be an interesting topic to bring on the channel and talk about again, since Jack and Daxter is easily one of the greatest video game trilogies I have ever played, and because I've been on a bit of a Jack and Daxter kick lately, let's give it a look. But please, keep expectations low for this one, trust me. So nearly a week ago, or whenever the hell it was, we had some posts floating around about Jack and Daxter possibly being one of the franchises to come back on the PS5 and apparently be a launch title for the PS5 as well. Rumor has it that there is a trilogy remake in the works, and while that sounds absolutely amazing, it also sounds way too good to be true. I'm not even gonna sit here and be like, take this with a grain of salt guys, because I'll be honest, this sounds like a load of crap. Before you click off, let me get into why of course. Now I'm not saying it's impossible, because it is not impossible for this to happen. I personally feel like Jack and Daxter is one of the only old IPs Sony really wants to bring on modern consoles. If you couldn't tell with them bringing it back on PS3 in a fantastic remaster, and then bringing it back on PS4 with some god awful and broken ports, they just keep dragging his dead corpse back. I just think that there's an absolutely nothing to go off of with all this. Sure, there's talk about it, you have some posts about it. But keep in mind, these are from 4chan and other websites that are home to bogus rumors that sound like a fan's wish list. Maybe I'd get excited for it all if there was actually something to go off of and bring some sort of hope for the comeback of the dynamic duo, but I think the majority of us learned our lesson from this whole 4chan rumor bullshit with Spyro Reignited trilogy. Remember the whole Treasure trilogy fiasco and how Spyro fans on Twitter were in shambles for a month straight? and got mad that the rumors they read on some website weren't true, and how these super duper secretive leakers with secret sources weren't correct? Yeah, I remember that. Had to be one of the most annoying things I've ever witnessed on Twitter, let me fucking tell ya. I'm not gonna rule out the possibility because this could very well happen. I wouldn't be surprised if Jack and Daxter does make some sort of return on PS5, but at the same time, it would be shocking as well if that makes any sense at all. A trilogy remake on these games would be amazing, and it's honestly something I'd love to see since Jack 4 died ages ago, and The Last of Us came out of it instead. Not a fair trade in my eyes, but you get my point. But my thing is, I feel like the opportunity for a major project or comeback for Jack also died ages ago. Sure, a lot of you are gonna say nothing is impossible and never say never, but the remasters on PS3 nearly sold 1 million copies physically. If you combine it with digital sales, I'm sure it hit well over a million. If the success of that, and the crying demand from the fans didn't do any sort of convincing, what will? The PS4 ports surely didn't help because it was so extremely lazy. Jack 1 ran okay, Jack 2 ran like absolute balls, and the audio was staticky, and Jack 3, while passable, was still laggy. Jack X I have no thoughts on because they have me fucked if they think I'm gonna bother with that port if the other three were huge fuck ups. Sure, the fan reaction was great, but when they actually came out fans were extremely disappointed and dissatisfied with them and they didn't even do anything to fix it. No. I personally think a trilogy remake would do great critically and financially. The remake trend is an easy way to bank and Jack and Daxter is one of the most obvious choices and one of Sony's most iconic characters in franchise. This would do some serious numbers. I'd also go as far and say that it's a missed opportunity if Sony doesn't hop on the idea. The fan demand is most definitely still there and this would definitely do well with newer audiences, Jack 2 and 3 especially. It would definitely bring in new fans to the franchise, but the thing with all this is, if we do get a trilogy remake, I think that's that. Nothing more would come out of it. Jack 4 is long gone, and I don't think Sony would go the extra mile and resurrect that due to the hypothetical remake success. It's a sad thing that we have to come to terms with. Not to mention, Jack 3 ended the series off perfectly. Well, almost. And I'm not sure if there's a lot to really expand upon after the third game. Lost Frontier tried to expand upon everything, but that was a colossal fuck up, and instead of a good game, we got Dark Daxter, and I can't for the life of me figure out why anyone thought this was a good idea. Dark Daxter was a joke, and as soon as that thing popped up on my screen, I realized that they really should have stopped at the third game. What a way to attain a near perfect franchise, you guys. Round of applause. To sum it up, I think it's possible, and I would love to see it despite the obvious concerns, but I just don't think it will happen. If there's an IP that Sony's gonna pull and bring back on the PS5 with a major project, I think it's gonna be Ape Escape or The Legend of Dragoon. As for Jack and Dexter, again, not gonna rule it out, 
but I just don't see it like I do with the other two games I've mentioned. At the very least, I could see Jack 1, 2, and 3 and X get a simple port again onto the PS5, and I'm ashamed to admit that I would more than likely buy it because I love Jack and Daxter and I'm just hopelessly obsessed at this point. But anyway, what do you guys think? Do you think Jack and Dexter could return? Would you want a remake, or Jack 4, or even both? Comment down below and don't forget to leave a like and smash that subscribe button. We're currently in the process of reviewing the first four Spyro games. First one is up, and I'm currently working on Spyro 2, so definitely stick around and join in on the fun, you will not regret it. With that being said, Jables Game signing off, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, and take care.